I'm in Tokyo this week, and right now I'm in my teeny tiny Japanese bathroom, getting ready to go out. But I thought it's the best place to unbox and test a new product from Shenzhen that I bought with me, an intelligent toothbrush. Yeah, I'm a bit skeptical too, but let's take a look. So you have to use an app to control it, or you can just use use uh, use it uh, on. I think there are buttons on toothbrush, and this is the QR code at the back. You can download it to go from Google Store. They have iOS version and um, Android version. So this is what it looks like. Let's turn it on and pair it with my app. So I just move up and down, and I see some numbers. Hold down. Oh. Ah, I see. You can select from the screen if I hold it, the mole, and go in to brushing strength. Just swipe up and down. You can see different settings. Level right shows the weather and the time. Good afternoon. Okay, slide to set. Okay, just slide. Uh, they have clean, white, or massage. Uh, and swipe up and down to choose. I would choose clean from here. Hold down. Okay. What else? Yeah. What if I, I let me check the apps? Now I see it is select toothbrush ID. Okay. The toothbrush I said number is wrong. Uh fine. Plans. You can also like it's the same interface on the app to the toothbrush interface. So strong cleaning, dark cleaning. Uh, because I I did not connect to it, so I'm gonna just going to see what is on there. If it's not connected, okay. Care. Basically the same function they have on the toothbrush interface. They also have it on their app. Now just ignore the app. I'm just going to use it as it is. Okay, two minutes, and I select hold down, and it puts some toothpaste in. Okay, some water. I think it's too strong for me. Maybe I just double tap it, make it work. Oh, yes. After you select the string, you have to hold hold the, um, you have to put your finger, like, I'm going to do it one more time. But I chose number three, right? So I have to hold my thumbs on number three. And then, success. Let me see. Oh, so much brighter. Thirty seconds left. Okay, finish. 
fish. Okay. Um, For me, I think it's very convenient to use it. Like, it's not difficult to use at all. I like the interface. I like, uh, uh, at first I didn't figure it out. Figure, when uh, I didn't figure it out, so it feels like I am trying to drill a hole in my teeth. But after I figure it out, uh, it's much better. Of course, the day one, you cannot see the result. It's not like magic. You can just use it once and see and the teeth will uh, whiten and stuff. Uh, but as for the app, you will see that they are going to... I think it records uh, daily of uh, the plan you use it, and you can even make plans from the app. Uh, the day one, you make a... Uh, if you are connected to your app with toothbrush, it will record everything. Uh, it's simple, but... Uh, it's more time for people who really, really cares about the teeth. Okay, that's the Oakland toothbrush reveal. What do you think? Worth it over a regular electric toothbrush? Uh, what would you like to add? Let me know in the comments. And I'm going to take a shower for now. No picking.